All right, guys, today we're gonna do a review, kind of walkthrough of the Riverview Room at the Bearskin Lodge on the river in Gatlinburg, Tennessee. And I'll show you some of the things I like, some of the things I don't like. And first, let me show you exactly which room that we are staying in, just in case you wanna request this room in particular. We are in room. It's right there, 507. They've got the theming all throughout bear paws there. So you first kind of walk in through this front and we're just now checking out. I wanted to give it some time. Um, I didn't want to just do a, a room review as soon as we got in. I wanted to check out the Wi-Fi in the room, see if there's any problems, things like that. So we're just checking out. So we cleaned up the best that we could, got the luggage out of here and now we're doing the walkthrough. So you walk straight in and of course the bathroom first and we've got these nice granite countertops everything's pretty updated here uh, you will have your own so you won't have to bring if you can use it a hair dryer there and if we look this way they've got these hangers here kind of in the bathroom area the toilet and shower is separated from the sink so that's actually a nice feature somebody can take a shower or go to the bathroom while somebody else is brushing their teeth or getting ready um, no closet in this uh, room which is very very unique so that's kind of a, an unusual and maybe inconvenient thing we didn't find it inconvenient we didn't hang much up we weren't here for that long iron an ironing board available for your use they work fine and the bathroom's really really nice as well all this kind of upgraded uh, look to it it looks really nice drains really nice we had a little bit of problems with the toilet and the flushing of the toilet not enough to where we had to call maintenance or anything like that but it was a little bit of an issue so i thought i would bring that up so you walk then back out of that area the bathroom area and then they've got again in place of a closet they've got coat hooks um, up here and you'll walk through now this is one of the really nice things about this room and i've done other gatlinburg um, hotels in the past is there is a lot of space for just a one single kind of standard hotel room this is a big one so first things first got this mirror here if you're looking to get ready and the microwave let's talk about the microwave the ice bucket obviously there's an ice machine on this floor um, the, the microwave is one of these old school, I haven't used one of these in forever, where you just kind of twist the knob. You don't punch any buttons or anything like that. It's a really old school microwave. It's not a mini bar, just a fridge. If you have leftovers, plenty of restaurants, great restaurants down here in Gatlinburg. And then a lot of seating, again, this seating section here. You've got a map of Gatlinburg up here. This whole extra sofa section, again, they don't have a closet, so what they don't have as far as closet space, they used as living space. I actually, I think I prefer that. The theming is great throughout. They've got these bare pictures on the wall. Uh, these rustic looking little end tables here, little alarm clock there as well. Nice, big, comfortable bed. And then we kind of keep moving forward here. There's your storage down there. And they gave you a Keurig coffee maker, and it's always stocked up if you have housekeeping. There is the TV, and you can see the weather down there as well. It has been hot. I'm filming this in July. They've got a fireplace. We haven't had it going. I just put it on just so you could see it because it does produce heat. Uh, so you can see it uh, as part of this review. Again, we're getting to the outside, which is probably the most important part for most people. A nice big, again, chair here. Just a really big and spacious place and here's the ac keeps the place nice and cool let's go outside check out the porch again i've done another uh, uh hotel resort review from gatlinburg in the past with one of these river views it's very similar in my opinion now if you choose this room you will be high up so it won't be quite as noisy you can still kind of see and get a good view but this room is almost at the end of the building, so you will have this road right here, kind of a cutoff uh, river view. It goes all the way down that way, but down this way you will have this road right here. All right, let's go back in. Let me see if I forgot anything. I actually did make a little bit of a list. Um, no safe, did I mention no safe? Real important one. I'm sorry if I didn't bring that up. There's no safe in this room, uh, so storing valuables, uh, you know, depending on how comfortable you are with having maid service in and out, we didn't have any problems, but I wanted to bring up there's no safe. Um, 
Nice bathroom, hair dryer, iron, good Wi-Fi. Some of the best Wi-Fi that we've had in any resort of anywhere we've stayed. And, and our cell phone service is really good here as well. The balcony, the lodge theme, and they also have, last thing here, um, some charging stations throughout, again, attached to this alarm clock. We found those really convenient, lots of plugs. That's it, that is the Bearskin Lodge on the river, the river view version. I hope you enjoyed it. Subscribe, like, all that stuff, and check out my resort review of this resort as well. Take care.